let's look at an ellipse instead. Here's an example, 4y squared plus 9x squared equals 36. Notice how the x and the y have traded places. That doesn't really mean anything or matter. We'll kind of talk about it as we go. Okay, let's go ahead and do the same step I just did on the previous problem where I'm going to take both sides and divide by the 36. So I have 4y squared divided by 36 plus 9x squared divided by 36, and that should be an equals 36 divided by 36, which is, well, I'll go ahead and write that down, which is 1. Okay, so now on this problem we can reduce this. 4 goes into 36 9 times, so this reduces to y squared over 9. 9 goes into 36 4 times, so this part reduces to x squared over 4. And of course that part is 1. There we have our basic formula for an ellipse. Let's graph it now. Now here's where we're going to start learning about a different formula that I haven't talked about yet. Notice how the number under y is larger this time. The number under x is smaller. The number under the x goes the x direction, and the number under the y goes the y direction. So what ends up happening with this problem, since we're going to go 2 the x direction, and we're going to go 3 the y direction, our ellipse is more vertically oriented, which means this is now the vertex and this is a vertex. The major axis is going this way. Vertical. And therefore the foci are lo always located on that major axis. So for this one the foci would be located here and here approximately. Now let's go ahead and practice finding the foci because we haven't done that on an example yet. So if you recall from the previous video, we go c equals a squared minus b squared and then we square root that. So in this case, which one is a and b? Well, a is always the longer one. So a squared is 9 and b squared is 4. So we end up with the square root of 5, which is approximately 2 point something. I don't know, I'm not going to use my calculator to find it right now. So it's a little bit past 2, there's one focus. A little bit past negative 2, there's the other focus based on this number from our little Pythagorean theorem. Okay?